people say that living in Alabama, that we are living in the buckle of the Bible Belt. And we have seen people draw together and unite. And it sort of reminds me of Job. Even through all of his storms, he still had the faith and trust in Jesus Christ. And that's what we've seen here today. One man told us he had not been in church in six, seven years, and uh, he just didn't know for sure that he'd go to heaven. But today he did pray. And he says now he knows he's sure where he would go if that storm came and took him again. So it had started just to, uh, you know, sprinkling something. Mm -hmm. Just raining a little, little bit and stuff. And then, you know, you can just feel the wind just, you know, picking up. As soon as I close the door to my house, you know, I hear something going, woo, 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 boo, 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 boo. I fell to the floor. Just like that, it was gone. People start coming out of their house and just, hey, 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 you know, that was a tornado or something. Okay, they said, oh man, you know. So we walked up to this little corner here, which is a little hill, and I said, you know, something's missing down there. The guy said, the apartments are gone. And I said, man, you know, look at the tree right here on the corner and stuff. He said, you ain't seen that. You need to look down there to where the church was. The church was gone. 15 seconds, it was over with. It just was quiet and still like nothing ain't even happened. Through all the storm, you still were able to, to talk to the Lord and renew your life today. Yes, ma'am, that yeah. is correct. When that storm does come that takes you away from here, you're ready. Now. I'm ready. All Amen. right. All right.